Um, so we've used the PSPs today um, to take photographs and upload them onto a computer of different students doing different emotions or different facial expressions to try and portray emotions. Um, it's part of a quite a large project we do with each group. Well, the PSP in particular, I find a really useful piece of, of kit because it's so versatile, but the students are also already familiar with it. Perfect for students that I deal with some of behaviour problems to get them engaged. Straight away, they see the PSP and they see it as something they want to be getting involved with, they want to be using, they want to be doing. We've used it um, not only with the camera attachment, but also to connect to the internet, um, to go on games, things like that. So, um, educational games, I want to say mass games. Um, and they are a great resource for us. We use the like Sony PSPs for taking pictures, videos, and like doing maths and science things on them. Um, we came in and like we do like feeling part, and then on um, Mr. Brown said we're doing the lesson and we got the cameras out and on the PSPs and we had to start you know making a PowerPoint to make like PowerPoints of pictures and you know like it says if you're sad, you're angry, you're happy and all that. And we did that, then we had to start doing a lesson, start taking the pictures of the people and seeing what the seeing would this say faces be the same what's on the feeling board. I think it'd be a lot better for the people who can't read properly because the pictures will because like the feelings what they look like on the pictures will make the person understand what they the win in the photo. The students use it weekly, whoever our student of the week is who's behaved the best throughout the week gets to carry one around and take pictures of all the different lessons we do, all the different subjects. Um, basically it's an opportunity to show off all the different types of work we do and how well we do. Um, and other than that we use it in lots of group work and just a different way to access similar lessons and lessons that have been going on for years but trying to do it in a, in a more up-to-date, modern way. It, gets, it helps you get used to technology. I think it's more fun because you're taking pictures and then if you put it on like a PowerPoint, people will understand what they're feeling and all that, so you don't have to write it down. Everyone should be using something along these lines to help students get involved and to help students move on to the next level. Um, paper and pen are going to be a thing of the past one day and there's going to be a lot of different technology to move forward and this is part of it.